Yeah, continue on, yeah. I forget what we were. Relation uh, to power. Oh, cool. You said we, we made a what? A spectacle. All right? That's beautiful, man. All right? We, we're a spectacle, man. Uh, brother said they were baby Amalekites. You know, but that's like, that's our future masters. You know what I mean? Yeah. Right. Literally, man. Mm -hmm. Right. Huh. This is Revelation chapter 2 and verse 26. And he that overcometh and keepeth my works unto the end, to him will I give power over the nations. Power, 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 power. We were reading earlier before it uh, switched off. Right? Power over the nations, man. But your description says you got the key word was what? Endure. Mm -hmm. You got to endure, man. How was I endure? Right, and don't miss what to be to made hard, man. That's right. So, so Moses, I brought him through the ring, man, and he took the, the majority of the punishment. Right? Like he said, I, my burden is life. So what we going through is life. Man. See, but well, yes, we have to endure, and it's gonna be a, it's gonna be crazy on this. Matter of fact, get Matthew twenty four and ten. It's gonna get crazy, man. It's gonna get crazy, I am, man. That's what the strip says is gonna happen. Matthew 24, verse 10. And then shall many be offended. Many gonna be offended. All right, go ahead. And shall betray one another. Betrayal, man. Oh my God. It's betrayal, man. Okay. Got dudes turning other brothers in. Family members. Especially them. Especially ones who got juice stuff too. All right? Neighbors betraying one another, man. Yeah. It's gonna be many betrayals, man. Because that's how much wrath this devil gonna come down with on the planet Earth. Mm -hmm. All right, yeah. And and shall hate one another. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And many false prophets shall rise and shall deceive many. Yeah, well, we're, we're seeing a lot of them niggas now. Yep. All right. A lot of false messiahs, man. All right, yeah. Verse twelve, Matthew twenty-four, verse twelve. Yeah, and even Andrew Tate's. Right. Them guys, he fall on underneath that category too. That's right. Right. <laughs> you know, a lot of these jigs did they, they influence and whatnot. A lot of people get caught and they bring on half truths. Right? And the other half is a lie, man. God. You know, good. And because iniquity shall abound, the love of many shall wax cold. Are we gonna see that? Are we gonna see. Oh, you heard about that woman who killed the um she killed the two children or something in the Bronx? I think it heard something like that. It was, there's a lot of judgment yeah, going see, on. Yeah, I saw a brother post that, yeah. That's that's the love of many waxing cold, man. Wait, did it wait, wait what wait, uh explain the story again? Yeah, yeah, I can't remember I can't what what that. what she did, man, but she, look it up. What, what's the reason why? She murdered them and kept them in there for a minute. Mm. I mean that's that's her two children, man. But you know all these women are gonna be doing that soon too. When the exactly. family because they did it back then. That's right. That's the love of many wax and colds. Because by uh, by default, a woman is um, attached to a child. They're inseparable. See, that's, that's supposed to be a mother's love, man. You know? But she, she killed two. And there was another woman not too long ago shot her son in the head. I mean, it's just crazy shit going on, man. She talks about people betraying one another, man. All right? Husband gonna be killing his wife, vice versa. Well, we seen a little preview of it with C19. Didn't you? Didn't they say domestic violence went through the roof uh, during the time of the pandemic? Right. All right. They couldn't stand beating each other's faces like that. Yeah, yeah. See, dead. All right, let me set. Lamentations four and ten. The hands of the pitiful woman have sodden their own children. Yeah. Yeah. And that's what they were doing back then. It was cooking them during the time of Babylonian siege, man. Babylonian siege. Boiling them, frying them, having these, you know, so fit. They did it uh the second king, the sixth chapter, you know? All right? They, they, he, they, she literally ate her own um, child. Yeah. You know? Literally. And they also did it in uh, the Romans. Yeah. When they surrounded Masada. Yeah. All right? That, that was crazy. That siege, nothing could come in and nothing could go out. Mm. 
And that's right. gonna be, be America Battle on the Great, especially the city. You got a movie called um, uh, Escape Manhattan that came out in 1988. You know? I'm watching that. Yeah, I was trying to say you was gonna be trapped on every side. Mm. He, he told y'all Jake's that back yeah. then. Yeah. He said, when you see it's Jerusalem surrounded, flee. Yeah, flee into the mountains. Okay, I'll see a lot of rebellious Israelites stayed and what happened? They got devoured. Right. And, and to show you how the most I was merciful, most of the apostles yes. got put to death before 70 AD. Yeah. Right? A lot of them died in 67, 66. The apostle Paul got beheaded, right? Peter, uh, according to the uh, secular records, got crucified upside down. You know, uh, all the apostles died, man, yeah. except for um, St. John the Revelator. You know, he was a prisoner on the island of Patmos because he had to complete the, uh, the book, man. All right, his, his job wasn't done, man. See, Yahweh Shai came to him. And what did Yahweh Shai tell St. John the Revelator? Let's get Revelation the 10th chapter. Okay. Said, I think it's seven where he said you have to prophesy again. Yeah. Oh, I get another one, Daniel. Hmm. This is Revelation chapter 10 and verse 11. And he said unto me, Thou must prophesy again before many people and nations and tongues and kings. Yeah, so he told him, Well, when did that happen? Mm. That proves reincarnation right there, because when right. did that literally happen? Right. He was already an old man. That's right. See? And the rumor was they threw him in a boiling pot and they didn't kill him, so that's why they made him a prisoner. You know? You know, because he had a job to do, man. Just like the Apostle Paul, when they stoned him and he didn't die, he had a, he had a job to do, man. Right. He had to finish. Just like uh, the brother had the vision of uh, uh, Simeon Toko. You know, they did all kind of things to him, man. And he said in the vision, Simeon Toko showed him the different scars. You saw that dream? Yep. Yeah. Uh, the, uh, the brother out there in Macon. Yeah, he said he showed him the different scars, man. And they, they, they said that story was kept hidden for a long time. Yeah. No, but that came out in the Black Jesus story. Yep. No? He said me many more that's gonna come like me. Yeah, and teleported you. You know? You know the least was terrified. Yeah. They was like, what the fuck? You probably had the, the garment on. You never know how you, you never did. Yeah, it's right, it's right. Yeah. Right. So Gar now, yo, you never know. Imagine that. Garment, garment blowing while he's talking. Yo, he's just blowing <laughs> in the wind, you know? You know. He just teleported out yeah. of Yeah. That's powerful, man. It's very powerful. See, so in the future there will be many more, many. You know? See? Man, and Evan Rothschild dead too, second in command. So you know, Jacob Rothschild, you gotta hurry up, man. You gotta hurry up, man. The clock is ticking. Man. Bring in, you know, your agenda, man. Yeah. Before you out of there. Before you out of there, because after you out of there, after this is the next stop is slavery. That's right. The queen is dead. Mm -hmm. uh, the, the, uh, the, the other guy before, what's that guy named? Prince man? Philip. Philip, he's dead, man. Charles, he old as shit. Never worked a day in his life. Now he's King Charles. He got to move too. All them guys are old. Yeah. Klaus Schwab is 82. Them guys are old, man. What's this other guy that's still alive, 99 years old? What's his name? Uh, George Soros? George, George Soros. There's another one. Um, Evelyn D. Rothschild died recently too. Ninety-two. There's yeah. another one though. Um, I know you. Not Brizzo Brzezinski, George Soros, and um, and he was doing out speaking. He's on the side. Henry Kiss is it Henry Kissinger. Look at Henry Kissinger real quick. Oh, you can. It's a lot. You on a double side? He might be. One of them. Ninety-nine years old, man. So you doing out speaking in, uh, in that little interview thing? Yeah. The that started like tearing. Yeah. Because America was going into shits. <laughs> this dude 99 years old, man. That's what she said. They're not in trouble as, as other, other men, men, man. And that goes to show that they're going to bring it soon. Yeah, okay, because the, the, those that really want this, they, they owe it, man. Yeah, the most so I they, made you live a full life. Yeah. So they about to bring, excuse me, oh, that's, go right, early 12 and 12. Uh, the devil coming down with great rap because he know it that he had but a short time. Yeah, the least is old, man. Yeah. You know? King Charles, he don't got that long to reign. Whatever time he got left, man. They gonna, oh, and he said it. Oh, he said in that video they took down on my channel. They took it down. 
the video is called Royal Satanist. Mm. And he said that he said we are literally at the last hour. He said that. Basically saying we, we don't got that much time left. Because according to them, they have to save the earth. For thou shalt rest and stand in thy lot at the end of days. Yeah, yeah, the end of days. All right, so he, Daniel will come. Daniel is back. I was, is, looking, yeah. I was looking for that in Job, too. Is it 14 or 14 or 19 and 25? One of them. Job is back. Oh, 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 most of the prophets are back. Some of them resting, you know, some of those passed away. But most of most of them are back. The nineteen twenty-five or fourteen and fourteen, one of them. It's it's brutal out here, man. The only good thing most I don't have it, it's not windy. Job chapter 19 and verse 25. For I know that my Redeemer liveth and that he shall stand at the latter day on the earth. He says, Though after my skin worms destroy this body, right. yet in my flesh shall I see God. I right. see the most high, yeah. That was the priest I wanted to get uh, in the apocrypha when it says, uh, I'll give for them leaders. You know what I'm saying? Matt, I'm going to pull it up. Yeah. Give to them leaders? Okay. Is this Sirach 49? It was one so, yeah, oh, yeah, I think it is Sirach 49. Raise up the prophet's bones against some. It's, it's one of 36 and 49, I think. I haven't read this in a minute. Yep. Sirach. I was going to Second Edges 1 and 39, if I may. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm going to start up some. All right. So, second Edges 1 in verse 36. They have seen no prophets. Matter of fact, so the chapter is beautiful. Uh, he said, I declare my Savior openly. There's all this. This whole all tight. Should come in the end of the world, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna start verse 33 if I may. Second Ezra 133. Thus saith the Lord Almighty, your house is desolate. I'll cast you out as the wind doth stubble, and your children shall not be fruitful. For they have despised my commandment and done the thing that is in evil before me. That's how we went into captivity. Yeah. Now, the reason why we're here in Babylon right now. Because Israel broke the contract. And right. you're still breaking a contract right now. We're looking at you Israelites right now, man. Niggas yep. smoking yep. weed, all this kind of wicked shit. God. You know, sagging yep. in 2022. Simple-minded, man. Yep. All right, go ahead. It says, your houses will I give to a people that shall come, which have not heard of me, yet shall believe me. To whom I have shown new signs, yet they shall do that I have commanded them. They have seen no prophets, yet they shall call their sins to remembrance and acknowledge them. I take to witness the grace of the people to come, whose little ones rejoice in gladness. And though they have not seen me with bodily eyes, yet in spirit they shall they believe the thing that I say. And now, brother, behold with glory. Yeah, and that's what Scripture says. There's a generation that sees his face. This is that gen, but just like in the past, in the wilderness, that old that old generation died. But the younger ones went in. That's the, that's the shaft that goes yeah. to the whole uh, history of the wilderness, the, you know? It's like a Joshua and Caleb, that's man. That's right. All right. It says, uh, And now, brother, behold with glory, and see the people that come from the east, unto whom I'll give for leaders, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, Hosea, Amos, and Micah, Joel, Obadiah. All the prophets again. Yeah. All the prophets again, man. Yeah. Right, there's nothing new under the sun. Yeah. Yet. Jonah, Nahum, Habakkuk, Zephaniah, Haggai, Zechariah, and Malachi, which, which is called also the angels of the Lord, the messengers. The messengers, yeah. So they're back. You know, majority, because you got, you know, majority of them are back. Maybe you got something probably in the spiritual realm. But, is is it Sirach 36? We said raise up the bones here, the 12. Is it 11? I'm not quite, yeah, I can't yeah. remember again.
Right. Sirach 36 and 15 give testimony oh, unto cool. those that thou has possessed from the beginning and raised up prophets that have been in thy name. Good. Reward them that wait for thee and let thy prophets be found faithful. Mm -hmm. O Lord, hear the prayer of thy servants. Is there anything more? They just said raise the prophets. Oh, uh, I'm going to skip, skip through it. Let me see. So I can. Matter of fact, there's one in 49. That's a good one, but there's one in 49. Raise the prophets that have been in thy name. Oh, it's possessed with thee from the beginning. Okay? Yeah. See? There's one in Sirach 49. We're talking about there's one, one on one with the 12. Huh. With the 12 bones of the 12 prophets, one of them. Huh. In Sirach 49. So this is Sirach 49 and 10. It says, And of the 12 prophets, let the memorial be blessed and let their bones flourish again out of their place. Yeah, which they back. The brother just read them. 12 prophets. All right, they back, man. But well, Esau called them minor prophets or whatever the case is. We're saying not minor, but. Yeah, I believe mean, uh, he yeah. does that based on like how the length of the books. Yeah, the length of the books. It's not. It's not been. It's, it's a spirit, it's man. A spirit. Because Obadiah is one chapter, one but it's, chapter. it's a powerful book. Same thing with Jude. Yeah, one powerful, chapter. man. Powerful. You know, every every brother had a lot of important. Because if you said every member of the body is important, very. Yeah. You think you think if you lose your toe, you're not going to notice it? Yeah. No, you're going to walk different. Yeah. <laughs> if, you, you if, you, if you're a basketball player, you won't be able to play like that. And if you are, it's not a not a fit. You lose your thumb, you can't grab shit, man. Yeah. That hit. Yeah. Your thumb is a vital part of your body. You lose your eye, you you, you lose one of your eyes. You think, oh, I still can see through my right eye. But no, you, you can't see nothing come from your blind side. Yeah. You, that's gonna bother you, man. You think that will bother Fetty, Fetty Walk? That's a, that's, a, a, that's, a, that's a disability. You, you lose an arm, you think you'll be all right. That's a disability. It's a disability, man. man. So that's why we're a body. The body of your house shy. Okay. Oh, yo. Each brother represent a beautiful stone in a new house. Yep. The, temple, the third temple. Spiritual. Okay? Ooh. Yeah, man. See? So we all we, we all have our own part or position to play. That's right. The Lord gave everybody a um, a talent. Yeah. And he wants you to um, maximize it. Mm -hmm. Bring back a uh, good game. Alright? Because why? He gonna reward us. Let's get that Hebrew six and ten or nine, I believe. Let's get that. Hebrew six and ten. I think it's nine or something like that. Run the one of the two. It's the book of Hebrews, chapter six and verse nine. But beloved, we are persuaded better things of you and things that accompany salvation, though though we thus speak. For the most high is not unrighteous to forget your working labor of love. Yeah, so this is labor of love. Because it's freezing out this bitch, man. You know? You know, we don't do what other brothers do. Every time we get cold, a certain camp, they go down to the Bahamas. <laughs> or they go to the warm countries. You know, which, you know, they're still doing the work. Of Puerto Rico. Yeah, but they, they they avoid that um that cold, man. In you know? season, out of season. Endure the elements. Yeah, it's okay. just trying season you know some brothers are, you know in other states they bless like florida or whatever they yeah, don't really yeah. taste that bitter you know just, yeah. up the highest like new york city uh boston boston rochester yeah Ooh, chicago chicago because it's by the four lakes alaska. detroit brothers in alaska yeah oh, man. australia too? yeah i know alaska it was, it was, uh, australia's heat is he okay Constance? yeah alaska alaska yeah, okay. yeah. alaska's just that's a different kind of cold man yeah. That's God. That's that Russia cold, Siberia cold. Brothers Over in there. Philly too. Yeah. In Philadelphia get cold. Yeah, the Northeast. Because yeah. we get all we get all four seasons. You know. You know what I mean. Especially like brothers at Rochester up there. All them areas up there, Rochester, yeah. Michigan, all by, by the lakes up there is freezing up yeah. there, man. Brothers in Europe too. Yeah. Oh. Some parts yeah. of Europe, yeah. yeah. Like brothers in England, it get, it get cold up there. 
you know? So, yeah, man. You know what I mean? But that's a part of the fight. And like we said, it's a light. It's a light. But we read it right now. It says, For the Most High is not unrighteous to forget your work and labor of love. Yeah, so the Most High, is, he sees everything. And he's going to reward us in due season. All right? In due season, man. When everybody losing their mind, we going to be in the, the secret place. Right? We going to be comforted, man. And we already seen a preview of that with C-19. Most I held us down. Everybody, they lost their goddamn mind. They lost their wits. That's why they ran out and took that thing, man. And they gonna pay for that, man. Because we brought talk about the zombie thing a lot. And then we say a lot of young people, a lot of people in general getting all kind of dropping dead. You said dropping, 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 yeah, dropping, dropping man. Oh, they mentioned that the particles in the air can cause you to have heart attacks. Come on, man. That BS, Is that man. We know BS. What's going on. They said particles and they said cold showers. Get the hell out of here. Who are you talking to? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. It said cold showers. Who you ever heard some shit? Everything but what it is. Everything but the juice. The finesse. You people got finesse for taking the finesse. Yeah. You got deceived, man. You got deceived, man. And scripture said everybody that consents unto them shall be yeah, had in derision. derision. You're gonna be mocked. And also he killed that uh he deceived those take Vanessa. Like the scriptures say, what he was even dumb that took the karate with the beast. So that was a prelude, and I was re-watching old videos that bros was doing through the spirit, going into that how the uh, the math was a prelude to the finesse, and the finesse was a prelude to the uh, karagma, man. Okay, it's all preludes. All right, so we know it's coming next. Ellie must had a show and tell. I didn't get to check it out. I know some brother checked it out through the spirit. All right, so we know what's going on, man. Yeah, we do a couple of minutes. He oh, might got a tip in the whole ass. You know, you heard Ellen Musk and turn around real quick. Yeah, uh, yeah. Jason Whitlock mentioned him like he's a hero. Yeah. Ellen Musk is an insider. Because he bought Twitter? What does that so have what? to do with anything? Oh, because he got trying to stress, like, the freedom of speech. Man, come on, man. Listen, America is not the home of the free and the home of the land of the brave, okay? It's the land of the slaves, man, okay? And unrighteous decrees and wickedness. Yeah, he, he, he was disgusted when um, Nate took mention of... Uh, no, I'm talking about a Black Wall Street. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's like, yeah, that was one incident. That was a major incident. And then he started to like line it up, like, well, you got Jake's that he didn't say Jake's, but he said you got Jake's that kill each other, destroy their own communities. It's not, man, if you go to the source of the problem, which we know the ultimate, okay, the curses, so on and so forth. But we go to the source of the problem. Who put the drugs in the communities? Who right. filled it up with guns? Okay, right. it was Esau, man. Who broke Jake, up the homes? Who broke up the homes? Esau, man. Right. I remember um, a Jake was telling a story about in Chicago how one day him and his friends, or I think it was just him, whatever, saw a crate full of guns, you know, and he all went in there, it was free guns, started grabbing them up. That's how guns got in different cities, man. Oh, and the a war. Lot of guys who started them gangs are agents. Literally, yeah. you guys threw up the same signs. Yeah. Six point star, five uh, point star. Where the fuck you get all that shit from? Right. Get that right, from. Right. You know? So their forerunners for the for the bloods and crips in them, they they all agents, man. Niggas are agents, man. Okay, like hats. They throw up the, the devil ones. Okay, we, we we see these things, man. Oh, we watched the show Snowfall, because that was based on, you know, true events. But they, of course they dramatized it. Alright? With the fun the whole war in Nicaragua, man. It's the CIA. Yeah. yeah. Boom. The um all in uh Iran Contra yeah. yeah. Oliver North. So that's how the drugs got into the communities if you was guessing. Yeah, how did drugs from Nicaragua get into the hood, man? Jake's in the hood don't got that to go around Nicaragua getting drugs. If if it was if it was literally Jake doing that, Esau would have been locked their ass up, arrested them. Yeah. You know, so who's bringing it in? They still. You know, so. after, after the damage was done, they swept y'all. They took they took down. The only reason why Ricky Ross is out right now is because um the whole uh, CIA thing. Yeah, that's proven. That's yeah. the reason why he's yeah. out. Yeah, yeah. Okay, his his plug was a CIA agent. Yep. And you do and that's, the, why, that's why that snow snowfall is loosely based off him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah okay. Come Because <laughs> niggas, man. And right. then if you go from that time period, the 80s, leading to the 90s, what was the next epidemic placed upon Jake's? Music, rap, hip hop. It started off conscious. Esau, like, nope, we gotta infiltrate that. And uh, 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 what's the word? Look for infiltrate and destroy that. Okay, we gotta make it. They they not speaking that conscious shit, man. Yeah, they didn't. They didn't want righteousness. Yup. Then he had a meeting. Okay, they had a meeting and said, "Listen, we need to. We need to. We have. We fund these different jails, prisons. We need to fill them up. A rap about this. 
So when people hear it and the frequencies, they get it's a spell. Yeah, because sound sound keeps the body together. Yeah. Like all the, all that nature, that's that's music, man. Mm, people know it or not. That's, that's a certain right. frequency. That's yeah. right. Like when King David played the heart for King Saul. Yeah. Okay. That's why some you know certain brothers like the nature sounds of the yeah. water flowing and yeah. just trees blowing in the air, rain. It's just a certain nature it's, sound it's, just pleasing to the soul. It's pleasing to your soul. All right. You know, the Lord created music, man. Yeah, but all everything now is just is just drill, drill, and drill, man. And it's a duality with everything in, in life. Like the scripture going to that too. It is basically there's always two sides. Okay, the Lord uh, created righteousness and wickedness. So you got the righteous sounds music to get you in the spirit of Yahweh Bashim Al Shad. You got wicked to get you in the spirit of Satan. You got man. demonic frequencies. Demonic frequencies, and that's what they started playing. That's all. That's all over the airwaves. Yep. Niggas with attitude on down to the to the gangster rap, on down to. Drill music in Chicago, on down to the drill music in New York City. Then we can't forget about the Harlem music. Yeah, uh, drill music in Europe. Even RB was adultery music, man. It's all adultery. You know that that Simp one simping. That one song with Nelly and Kelly Kelly Rowland. Uh, yeah. That was adultery, man. She said all songs was adultery in the fifties, sixties. Right. You know that song, right? Seventies. 80s. Yup, yup. All those songs were nothing but adultery, man. Like, they literally, they literally said in that. Keith, Keith Sweat begging ass. Keith, yeah, Keith Sweat. <laughs> sweating over these hoes, King, man. King Susip, man. Twisted over these bitches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That nigga was a damn. That's begging shit, man. Yeah, you gotta man. Hear all that, man. Oh, it was a Queen of Heaven spirit, too, with I mean, them guys could sing, but they also, that was that Queen of Heaven spirit yeah, yeah, spell, yeah. man. Like, these hoes are something precious to be chasing after, man. Yeah. And that's why you don't hear too much R&B no more. That simple shit is yeah. out of there, man. You got songs like I Should've Cheated. Yeah. I Should've Cheated. Who's something like Oh, you can't Cole. forget, what's his name? R. Kelly. R. Kelly was talented. <laughs> like, what? R. Yeah, Kelly okay, was yeah, talented. He was talented. But he promoting it. Nothing. All his shit was adultery, man. Oh, right. yeah. Bumping and grinding ignition. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, all this shit. All, all this shit. Mr. Yeah. Still Your Girl. Yeah. Okay, that was Trey songs in that too, if I'm not mistaken. That was the Trey songs. Oh, okay, that was I'm them too. Sure. I know it's one of them. Trey songs, man. Wicked ass yeah. niggas, man. They, so music industry promotes them, but adultery, sodomy, okay, uh, uh, death. That's a stumbling block. Want to give it um, him drink so he could see his uh, nakedness? That's, that's what he did. That's wicked, man. Because he know he know Jake uh, got the style. Jake got flavor. Jake, yep. you know, like all these nations, <laughs> they imitate you. I seen it the other day. These Arab kids. Talking shit, yeah, female do. kids. They was like, they talk just like Jake, man. Yeah. She's yeah. like, uh, she said something. Oh, yeah, I stole something. Uh, don't blame me because I'm black. Some shit she stupid bitch said. I was like, what the fuck you talking about? And then you had another, um, some other Arab kid. He's like, he's like, suck my D, nigga. I was like, listen to them. That's how they talk to each other. They talk just like Jake, man. Yeah. Because, uh, and, and get, they all got what? Jordan's on. Yeah. Who did they get that from, man? They didn't get that from their country. Because Esau took these um, uh, Israelites from Yemen, Turkey, and shit like that, put them in the hoods, and let them get bodegas, okay, to sell uh, Marlboros and uh, Fort Liquors. And, and, how they, and how did kids get influenced? They're looking at hip hop. That's right. See, they're looking at you niggas. And, and then and the, yeah. the Jakes that go into the stores talking their shit, they see him, they like their swag. Okay, he's, he's sagging his pants, his ankles. I kind of like that. Rip, you know, all the stuff like that. They're looking, you know, yeah, where they get it? Where they get their fashion from? Well, it's for Jake. They be wearing some damn jeans and sandals, man. <laughs> right, right. <laughs> and turbans, okay? <laughs> looking like Aladdin. Yeah. That's how they be, that's what they, that's what you should be doing. Yeah, that's okay? what they be looking like, man. Flying on your fucking carpet, man. Yeah. But they look at Jake and like, okay, that's a, that's how you do it. Yeah. You no. Know? Israel is a form of all. Yeah, things. man. And Jake do got soap. They know how to make like uh, something else because a lot of their styles are goes back to how we was dressing in slavery in that cycle, like ripped jeans. Okay, not nothing wrong, brothers. They wear it, but I'm saying like it goes back to slavery. How we had little holes in our jeans. All the style comes. All the style comes come, come from the ghetto. Yeah, go from the ghetto. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, Jake is want to mix and match. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like all the Yeezy style brands that Kanye came up with was all like slave shoes, slave slippers, stuff like that. You know, holes in it. Why? Because that's how he's rocking in slavery, man. Yeah. Okay. It's, it's, in, it's in your spirit. Yeah. As soon as them hip hop artists in the past, in the 80s, they didn't have wealth. So, but how they know as soon as they get money, it was what the, the big chains, rings on every finger. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Where did Jay get that from? That was just in his spirit. Yeah. Yeah, because what did King Solomon say? Yeah. Chains of yeah, yeah. gold, good yeah. grills. Yeah. King Solomon said he had their mouth filled with gold too. The Mosai, yeah. What's that, what's you that? know, because the Mosai, the Mosai, 
it's, you know, like we said, that's a that's a uh, Israel relation with the Most High. The Most High decked us out pretty much. Basically. Matter of fact, get Ezekiel 16 and 12. We may close it out soon, actually. Damn. You gotta check your battery too, because I know when you film. They'll tell you though before it dies. Tell you? Okay, yeah. read that right quick. It's on Psalm. Yeah, yeah. Song of Solomon 1 and 10, thy cheeks are coming with rows of jewels, thy neck with chains of gold. Yeah, the Lord, the Lord, the Lord decked us out. We're gonna read it right now. Okay, you got it. Ezekiel 16. This is this is the book of Ezekiel, chapter 16, verse 12. And I put a jewel on thy forehead, and earrings in thine ears, and a beautiful crown upon thine head. Uh-huh. That was thus was thou decked with gold and silver. Yeah, the Lord decked us out. Okay, we had chains. Crowns, yeah. jewels, right? Read about the priesthood, man. They had all oh. kind of gold and precious stones in their garments, man. Yeah. King Solomon's uh, the, the time when he reigned, what? Yeah. Gold, everything. Yeah, everything was gold, man. Right. Remember, you know? Queen Sheba thought his servants were him. <laughs> That's how decked out they That's were. That's how they decked out they were, man. Yeah. She said she lost her breath when she saw his kingdom. Yeah, fainting. Yeah. Got you know? up. And she's a queen, so yeah. it's not like she's just some average chick. She's used to royalty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah. you know, King, like we said, King King Solomon in Israel just had salt. Mm -hmm. It was different, mm -hmm. All right? And when the kingdom of heaven comes, it's gonna be far better, man. Oh, man, that was like a that was like a forerunner for the kingdom. Because King Simon was Yahweh shot. Yeah, it was just a preview, man. Yeah. Uh, and the temple of the Lord was decked out with gold too. That's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, most side, most yeah. side, yeah. Most is the ultimate Jake. Everything gotta have style. It gotta have flavor. Mm -hmm. That's what he said right there. I had to. I, I decked you out. You know. You had the chains, the golds. We talked about the priesthood. But Most High decked out Aaron and the sons of Aaron. Mm -hmm. You know, Solomon's kingdom. And like Yahweh Shai said, put his one head that's greater than Solomon. That's right. See, our, his kingdom is gonna be far greater, man. Now, the scripture says we're going to be joint heirs, man. Mm -hmm. You know? Call him like Yahweh Shah, man. Shai. Well, we're going to be decked out again, but right now, the scripture said we have to prophesy on the sackcloth. Mm -hmm. okay. We ain't out here to be um, stunting. Right. This is, this is not our rest. This ain't the time. And most of the gold you niggas get is fake any damn way, man. Yep, literally. Fake ass shit. Discoloring. Yep. A lot of you niggas are. Uh, Rinsing the jewelry out and give it right back. Oh, right. Man. A lot of you niggas, you know, yeah. next to be turning green, yeah. fingers turning green. Yeah. Giving all these, these these heathens, these Amalekites, all that money. And this shit ain't even real, man. Yeah. Jake the Jula, whatever what these niggas be going to, man. Paying oh, all that yeah. money. That? Uh, uh, and this shit ain't Johnny even real. Johnny Dane. Yeah, yeah, Johnny Dane. The, the, right, right there on Fifth yeah. Avenue. A lot of them guys. Yeah, a lot of them guys. Yeah. Fake ass shit, man. Right? Talking about this amount of carrots. This shit is fake, man. Right. right, so in the kingdom, we gonna have the scripture says they gonna that's in the kingdom, that's all they're gonna be doing day and night. The scripture says our gates gonna be open continually. Yeah, we're gonna have the best of the gold, the best right. of everything because we're gonna have the heathen nations digging, mining, getting the best gold, man. And then imagine and on other planets, a type of treasure gonna be on other planets. Yeah, they, it can be yeah. new precious metals, yeah, new elements, that, metals. yeah, elements that's never been seen before. That's right. I saw has a periodic table, different elements. It's gonna be all kind of elements, man. Yo, you say, oh, oh didn't I, didn't say Sirach was a Sirach forty three? We only seen a few of his works. That's right, let's that's get right. that. I'll get that. Close on like about six minutes or so. That'll be like two hours twenty something. something like that. Sirach forty three and thirty two. There are yet hid greater things than these be, for we have seen but a few of his works. Few of his works, few, and they still searching things out. They right. still discovering Kepler's two super Earths and shit. Yeah, there's uh, there's there's uh, scripture says there's scriptures, there's creatures newly created. Yep. Even in Sirach 43, was it 20? Okay, Sirach, I'll go back to you. Sirach 43 and 20, it says, when the cold north. We're talking Sirach about like sea creatures and whatnot. Okay. Uh, no, um, uh, uh, 40, 24, Sirach 43 and 24. Um, they that sail on a sea tell of the danger thereof, and when we hear it with our ears, we marvel or we marvel thereat. Thereat, 
for therein be strange and wondrous works, variety of all kinds of beasts and there's, whales created. There's all very of all kinds of beasts. And it, like we brought out before, 25% of the ocean has even been discovered. Mm. So what's what's under the deep, man? That's a whole nother world in itself. It's a man. whole nother world. That we got to explore. That we got, we gonna explore that. Yeah. Like the brother talk about different planets, it's all kind of other yeah. marine life, different planets, man. That's why I do the spirit. We may explore the entire Earth first. That's why the spiritual, you know, yeah. Avatar and these movies coming out again because that's how you see how big they were in um, um yeah. and the, the size of the fruits in the yeah. first one. Yeah. That's how we gonna go back to. Mm -hmm. All right. Minus the blue skin that bug out Jake. He's like, why do you think? What do you think they were trying to show you an Avatar, <laughs> man? Come on, man. That Jake was bugged out, man. I remember when. Um, Vocab was debating the, the brother Nikon for watching the issue. He said to bring out white and ruddy and all of that. And Sapphire, Nikon say, so you got people walking around that's rainbow color? They walk like, like rainbows? You know what I'm saying? White, red, yeah. and blue. You don't, even, <laughs> you don't even understand you don't even what that's talking about, man. man. So that Jake that said, we grew back in the day, you're, you're bugging too. Nigga, you bugged out, man. The Lord formed Adam uh, from, from, the the dust of the ground. from the dust of the ground. People of color, yeah. they're different shades of brown. That's sure. it. Ain't no blue man walking around. Weirdo man. Right? The talk only colors are different shades Egyptian. of brown and red. Yeah. <laughs> no different shades of brown and different shades of red. Yeah. That's what that's it. Because yeah. Esau is a red man. Yeah, because he has no color. No he has color. no hue. Boom. Why? Because it's a mark, it's a curse. So he's not even a human. You know, so it has, it has nothing to do with no, there's no blue people walking around, man. Good. See on the internet, this TikTok era, you could just say any damn thing. Yeah, it sound deep. Yeah, you know, I'll be finding myself sometimes scrolling through, looking, and then you find something. They'll say something right quick. You like, let me see what they're talking about. Noah was born, and his light, his face shine, his eyes was red, and he then he then he showed extraterrestrials. Yeah, they got that from uh, the book the Jack Jasher. Yep, yep. he said that too. I think he said from the book of Jasher. He said that's a swipe, swipe. Like get the fuck out of here, man. People are retarded. Okay. Jasher, man. Stick to seek out of the book of the Lord. And man. read. Right. None of these shall fail. None shall wonder. You can't make the book of any other book, man. This is the. This is it. You gonna start? Uh, then King Solomon going to that too? You gonna lock yeah, yourself up? Yeah, making the many books. Yeah. Man. There's no end. There's no end. Because he searched all this, these different things out. Yeah. Because like, he had time. Yeah. As a king, he said he searched that all madness. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He, found, he searched out the reason of things. Mm -hmm. Today, you will call that a, what? A psychologist and a psychiatrist. He studied the mind. He studied human behavior. He said he studied the animals. He said he knew um, the difference between the different seasons. Mm -hmm. He knew the makeup of the elements. He studied storms. Because he had time on his hand. And guess what? He prayed for wisdom. And he realized that wisdom was what? It was the beginning and the sense of creation. Mm -hmm. The most I give him understanding of all those things. That's right. And he said he understood the wickedness of folly. That's right. And he knew that the, the head of all that wickedness was the woman. Mm. Solomon was breaking stuff down, man. I got a quick one. Come on. Uh, uh, Ecclesiastes, Ecclesiastes 12 and 13. Let us hear. Matter of fact, I can start it up. We just recorded this. Lock here. Verse 12. And further by these, my son, be a modest of many, of making of many books. There is no end. There's no end, man. You can see today it's all different kind of philosophies because of these damn books. Yep. All right. And most I made a simple one book, man. Do we go into other books, history and whatnot? Yeah, but it has to link to scriptures, man. That's right. Everything goes because why? What's the scriptures? The scriptures is the foundation. That's right. Okay, you need to have a foundation, man. If you're into different books and different philosophies, you all over the place. Let's get that feature 414. Con. We may close it out soon. Con. So finish it out right quick. Con. It says, and much study is awareness of the flesh. Awareness of the flesh. Yeah. Let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. Uh -huh. Fear Yahweh, which, Hashem Yahweh. Which is truth is based upon, mm -hmm. which equals wisdom. Yeah. Fear equals wisdom. Yeah. And keep his commandments. Yeah. For this is the whole duty of man. That's man's entire duty. That's the Israelites' man's entire duty. Yeah. That's his purpose. Yeah. All right. Everybody talking about purpose lately. The purpose is what? Fear the Most High, keep His commandments. Right. The guy sees it. You must keep the commandments. Right? They always stress that, man. And what did the heavenly but, Father? But part of the commandments is is the name. Right. And that scripture says, "Don't take His name in vain." Mm. That's one of the Ten Commandments. Yeah. And, and yeah. also, vain. You, 
one part of saying an emptiness, but you make it light of it too. Yeah. Did not there was a uh, uh, scripture where the uh, the Egyptian was disrespecting the Most High's name, man. Mm. And they put his ass to death. Mm. All right. He was striving with the Israelite. He made light of the Most High's name. He got put to death. I and mean, I think that's a number somewhere. We don't mm. gotta get it. But let's get Ephesians 4:14. Come and close this out. This is the Book of Ephesians, chapter 4, verse 14. That we henceforth be no more children tossed to and fro and carried about with every wind of doctrine. Every wind of doctrine. Reading these different books, right? Carried away by every wind of doctrine. We're not children, man. The scripture says, in malice, let's be in malice, when it comes to malice, let's be children, but in understanding, let's be men. Alright. So I don't know if any of the closing comments will close it out. Con, uh yeah. do the spirit repent. Do the right of blacks, Hispanics, Native Americans. The whole duty of man is fearing Heavenly Father through His Son Yahweh Shah in these last days, keeping the commandments which you've been commanded by the Most High Yahweh to believe on the Son, hear ye Him. So it's through Yahweh Shah we make it in the body here. All right, so it's not solely based on the law. Yes, you keep the commandments to the best of your ability, but you gotta have faith in Yahweh Shah. Faith words go hand in hand. So we in the time now to repent and get right, await for your, you know, uh, the, the, the day draw nigh. The key of heaven is at hand, or help us to break loose. We're about to die by famine, death, bloodshed. All right, so it's time to repent. Turn back to the heavenly father, Yahweh, to your son, Yahweh, shy, man. Or else, you're going down. All right. Now, yeah. I'm going to say, Call the name, Lord, Yahweh, Shem, Yahweh, shy. Give a double honest LGMS. Right. Honest to you, And peace and bless your brothers and sisters that listen, the hopeful elect. With that, we're going to say, Shalom. Shalom. Shalom.